Hi guys, it's Jodie and welcome to a new video. So today I'm going to be unboxing the January Illumicrate box. I'm pretty sure it's January's but I always get confused. So it finally turned up and I'm so excited. I did get spoiled for the book, I think. I'm pretty sure that is the book from Illumicrate. Yeah, sadly I know what the book is but I'm also really happy about the book as well. So yeah, if you guys would like to see what is in January's Illumicrate box and what the book is for the box as well, then please keep watching this video. Get yourself a nice cup of tea or a coffee or something and get cozy and let's get into the unboxing. So mine has come in one of the cardboard boxes this time around so I'm assuming that maybe the yellow ones are like not available at the moment. So this month's theme was Royal Secrets. So I'm excited to see what's going to be in here. Ooh, okay. So I think we have a jigsaw. Okay, yes, we do. So we have a We Hunt the Flame themed jigsaw. This looks so cool. I have a Lord of the Rings one of these I got in a previous Illumicrate box. And these are like so cute to put on your bookshelves as well. Um, So it looks like this here. And then this is the spine. And then the back. So it almost looks like a book. So you can like put this on your shelf like that and it will look like a book which is quite cool and then that's obviously the image inside that the puzzle makes as well so yes that is really really cute I don't generally do a lot of puzzles but sometimes I do so I may end up doing this if not I'll probably just display this on my bookshelf because it is really really pretty so that is the first item <gasps> then the next item is some cozy fuzzy socks I love fluffy socks oh my god okay these are literally like my favorite thing ever so these are under the orange tree socks and these are inspired by Pride of the Orange Tree. Um, so they look like this. They're like white and fluffy. And they have this really cute design here as well. Um, I want to see how fluffy these are. I just love socks. Like I love getting bookish socks. Don't know why, but I do. Oh my god, these are really soft. They're really big too. Like they, these are massive fluffy socks. Um, yeah, I can't wait to snuggle up in those. They are so soft. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy with those. Like I literally love socks. <laughs> okay, so... There are two books in here this month. I did get spoiled for the other one as well, but I will open those last. So next we have a necklace. Oh my god, this is so pretty. Wow, that is so pretty. Okay, let me figure out what this who this is inspired by. So the necklace is inspired by the Never Tilting World, and I have no idea what that is. Is that some kind of book or is it to do with the book of the month i don't know can someone let me know in the comments if they know because i don't know what that is i've never heard of it but the necklace is so pretty and i will definitely wear this so it looks like this it has a moon and crystals on it and it says night and day rule from their two thrones and there is a little moon and crystals on it and it's gold with the writing on it this is so freaking pretty so it comes on like a gold chain like this I will definitely wear that like that is definitely like me like obviously I love anything with the moon on it so yeah I really really like that that is so so pretty um, but I don't know what the never tilting world is so if someone could let me know maybe I do and it's just like slipping my brain right now and um, off the top of my head I cannot think what that is okay so I think this is a phone stand this next item it's really pretty. This is a phone holder and it's inspired by the prison healer. I read an arc of that last year and I actually really, really enjoyed that. But I haven't read the rest of the series yet. I know the second book's already out. I haven't picked that up yet. I kind of don't remember a lot of what happened in that book. I just remember it landed on a massive cliffhanger that reminded me of the end of Akamath. So I do definitely want to get the second book. I just haven't. But anyways, this is the phone holder here. It says you're a survivor on it. And it has this really nice like kind of floral design on it and i always put these together wrong every single time am i just really stupid i can never get these things like I mean it's standing up but it just like like it just falls back out can someone let me know in the comments if i'm doing this wrong i assume it does it just go like this but like there's no way that it stands up and you can't just tilt your phone on it like that because that's just like a weird design and it just falls anyway like this just slides back out so yeah can someone tell me in the comments what i'm doing wrong and how the hell you work this thing but either way it is really pretty but realistically i'm just not really gonna use this so yeah i think that's all the items yeah so that's all the items so i'll open the extra book first um so the extra book is this one here i think this is an illumicrate exclusive edition which is the ivory key by akshaya ramen and it says four siblings a country in ruin one quest to save them all and this is a stunning cover look how beautiful this is 
and then it has blue sprayed edges and this is the back as well so yeah, if you want to know what this book is about then you can pause now and read the blurb but yeah this is a really really nice little edition i've seen this book around as well in like the bookshop so i have heard good things about this and it is always nice when a book box includes like an extra little book so now let's move on to the book of the month which i think is this woven kingdom by tahira murphy we have a letter from the author here and then we have our book as well so okay so it is yes this is so so pretty um so this is this woven kingdom by tahira murphy and it has like bees on the front as well like look how beautiful this is this is so pretty and then the spine and then here is the back oh my god this is absolutely stunning like yes yes i love it i love it oh my gosh look at the inside as well okay so there's an art print inside that has a letter is that the same oh hang on right okay this letter is from the paperback book um this is the one for the book of the month here um so it has a letter from tahira murphy and then we have the art print and then we have these gorgeous end pages inside so pretty oh my god the sprayed edge did i even show you that look at that sprayed edge that is one of the most like pretty sprayed edges i've ever seen signed of course as well which is so cool oh i like this that this is blank because you can put like when you read it and stuff in here or like a stamp or something so i like that oh my god that is so so pretty i love it when books have stuff like that in guys this is just so so pretty oh my goodness okay yeah i'm in, i'm literally obsessed with this book this is so gorgeous i'm actually planning to read this in february or march because i do have an arc of it i just didn't get around to reading it um, but i think i am going to be picking this up soon and now i'm even like more excited so i'll read the synopsis that's on the back of the book so it says clashing empires forbidden romance and a long forgotten queen destined to save her people friggin love forbidden romance yes please to all the world alizi is a disposable servant not the long lost heir to an ancient jinn kingdom forced to hide in plain sight crown prince cameron has heard the prophecies foretelling the death of his king but he could never have imagined that the servant girl with the strange eyes the girl he can't put out of his mind would one day soon uproot his kingdom and the world oh my god i love the sound of this this sounds so good it sounds like my kind of book this is an absolutely gorgeous edition as well i'm just so happy with this book this is probably like my favorite thing in the box and then maybe the fluffy socks because i love fluffy socks i'm so so excited for this book i've had so many good things and i love forbidden romance and a long lost forgotten air like yes please so yes that is everything that is in this month's january box please let me know what your favorite item was in the comments and let me know if you have read this book or you're planning to read this book as well so we can chat about it there if you made it to the end of the video then leave a little bee emoji in the comments because i think this is a bee and it's quite cute and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up as well if you did enjoy it i will have a link to this book and illumicrate a website in the description box as well and i will also have a link to my patreon where you can find extra content from me such as a reading vlogs a monthly buddy read a discord and many many other things as well as all of my other social medias and that sort of stuff but yes i hope you guys are all safe and well i hope you're reading lots of good books and i'll see you in the next video bye